when you talk about the safe this is now part of the process mm -hmm. of you getting the firearm before you receive even your permit or you're given your 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 your, your, your certificate mm. to go and purchase this particular firearm there is a form that has to be filled by your OCS mm -hmm. the OCS is the custodian of the firearms within his area his area means area of his jurisdiction yes so you have to take this form to the OCS your OCS will come to your house he has been trained to know what kind of a safe is accepted and is acceptable and how it's supposed to be installed in the house mm -hmm. it's not supposed to be a safe that can be movable meaning it has to be to be tightened onto the wall using roll balls and everything else to make sure that that safe does not move it can't you can't come and steal the safe just pull it easily and, mm -hmm. and go away with it it has to be a proper safe which is fireproof it has to be a proper safe which cannot be easily accessed by mm -hmm. anybody who's not permitted mm -hmm. to access it it either has codes it either has uh, lockable edges on both sides. There are many other things that they look at mm. as, as OCSs. The OCS, once he comes and looks at this safe, inspects it and approves that it is okay, then he signs the form, keeps a copy of it, and the other copy is taken back to the firearm licensing board, yes. which they file and now give you permission to proceed and procure. That is the safe that your firearm is supposed to be in. Mm. It's not meant to be in your drawer when you're not attending to it it's not meant to be in your vehicle when it is unattended right it is not meant to be in your glove box when it is unattended it is not meant to be in your office drawer when it is unattended if i remove my firearm and i place it in my office drawer i must be there with it if i wake up from that office and i'm going to the next office i will pick up my firearm and holster it mm. and if i want to put a secondary safe in my office i need to inform the firearm licensing board that I have a secondary safe in my office, which mm. is located in location X, Y, Z. And then I believe they will inform the OCS of that particular area yeah. to inspect that safe, then allow you to put the firearm in the safe. Mm. The firearm is not supposed to... Then you have a small safe. When you get a secondary firearm, say you get a shotgun yes. for purposes of uh, extra self-defense, mm. and you have to... Or, or for sports and you request for the same from the firearm licensing board they will secondarily ask you to get a secondary safe yes for the shotgun you can get a long safe which fits a shotgun and a firearm mm -hmm. and, and, a, and a pistol but you cannot have a, a, a safe a small safe for a pistol then you take your shotgun along a, a rifle then you go and place it somewhere okay. say under the bed yeah. oh, that is not allowed 